Welcome to another GL Communications product demonstration video. This is a continuation of our Packet Expert series, which is our hardware platform for advanced Ethernet and IP testing. We will demonstrate a bit error rate test at 10 gigabits per second using Packet Expert. For this simple demonstration, we will directly connect the two ports via SFPs and a fiber optic cable. The bit error rate test will be run in both directions. We will measure bit errors, frame loss, throughput, and other statistics. Next, we will show the Packet Expert software. First, select All Port BERT from the drop down menu. Click on the interface for port 1 and verify that the link is operational as indicated by green LED. Also verify port 2. Click on Transmit Configuration. Here we will just send Ethernet frames, so layer 3 is set to none. Click on the MAC tab to set the source and destination MAC address. Click on the BERT tab to set the bit error rate pattern, and click on the traffic tab to set the frame size and the data rate, which in this case will be 100% of the line rate, or 10 gigabits per second. Repeat the configuration for port 2, ensuring that the bit error rate pattern is the same. To start the bit error rate test, control click on BERT under each port and then select Start. Double click all ports to see the live status of the bit error rate test. Green LEDs indicate that both ports are receiving traffic, that the bit streams are synchronized, there are no bit errors or out of sequence packets. Packet Expert provides other statistics such as the total frames transmitted and received. Notice that the data rate is approximately 10 gigabits per second in the transmitted and received direction. You can also graph the throughput for either port. Here we show time on the x-axis and throughput on the y-axis for both port 2 and port 1. We have no bit errors so far during this test. However, to manually insert a bit error, double click bit error insertion. Select which port to insert the bit error on and select the rate at which the bit errors should appear. Then click Start. Going back to the graph, we now see the presence of bit errors, as indicated by red circles. Furthermore, if we double click on all ports, we notice that the LED has turned red, indicating that there are now bit errors present during the test. Finally, you can double click reports and export a report in PDF or CSV file formats. So this is how you run a bit error rate test at 10 gig speeds with Packet Expert. 